the dick sucking was a grade <laughs> C minus D I'm, average. I'm going oh, to it was tell bad. anyone listening. I can't describe it, but there's something called the fucking Cooper special. And I know that's why you're about to start talking about sucking dick. <gasps> Cooper <laughs> special. You heard it here first. Dad, Talent. No. Talented. What are you ta- okay, so oh, you want to talk about blowjobs. I will. Uh, let's just do I it. Mean, let's get into the fucking blowjob topic. I would appreciate it if the Cooper special is put on hold. And let's talk about the motherfucking Gluck Gluck 3000 slash 9000. Boom. Sophia's face is like, here you go, Alex. You take this segment because I don't know what the fuck. What the hell just just came out of your mouth? All right. Every man listening, you may honestly think you have no idea what this is. You... However, I I pray to God, you have experienced this, but you just didn't know how to name. Ladies listening, let me just say, I promise focus is key right now, girls, because this will change your sex life. So a little birdie, a male birdie told me, and I want to call him something because when I say a little male birdie, this guy is maybe the most experienced guy I know in sex. Birdie. No, (laughs) let's call him Male X. Male X is the most well-versed man. He has had sex with every kind of girl, every nationality, every age. He's doing MILFs, younger girls, older, you name it, he's done it. So I trust his opinion because he he fucks, okay? (laughs) Hi. (laughs) So he basically told me, and girls, I know you're all like, Alex, what is it? He claims, and I quote, the Gluck Gluck 3000, 9000 is every man's kryptonite. Now every guy on here is like, oh my God, oh my God, wait, wait, wait. (laughs) Every guy in the room is like, all right, bitch, tell us, tell us, what is it, what is it? All right, so I will give you the little definition of this Gluck Gluck. It is a vacuum seal, double hand twist, gawk gawk combo. No. Sophia just fell out of her chair. She's like, what? Vacuum seal, double hand twist, gawk gawk Can we talk combo. about a blowjob now and not a vacuum cleaner? No. <laughs> Let me tell you. Listen, any girl can give a blowjob. It is the accessories that you bring with that blowjob that make America great again. Oh. I swear to God, I'm not a Trump supporter. <laughs> Fuck me, huh? Okay, so let me just say, you're like, well, okay, what's the vacuum seal? The vacuum seal, let, let's just, everybody close your eyes and picture. Closing. You're in the, You're in the Sahara Desert, and you are parched. You need water. She's been trapped in the Sahara. It's been three days, and she needs water. And his wiener, his wiener, is a big, fat gallon of Poland spring water. Okay? Sophia's like, okay, wow. okay, here we go. So naturally, 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 anybody that is parched, they will die to get to that water. They would die for dick at that point. They will- I would die for dick at that point in the you, Sahara Desert. You will die for that motherfucking so, dick. So you're saying... Blowjob has to be you acting like you are about to die for that dick. Listen, if a guy looks down and he sees a girl that's like, okay, I wonder who I'm going to have for like dinner tonight. And like, oh my God, when is this going to be over? Like, why hasn't he come yet? And he's yeah. like, okay, well then here we go. I'm getting soft and so Okay, it's over. You need to look like I am starving. I am going to die until he literally gives me that. Oh God, I'm sorry. No. He gives me that gallon of water. Oh, shit. The white, the white, it's a little bit white. So you're dying, you're (laughs) dying to get that. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The emphasis, okay, the emphasis on the Gluck Gluck 3000 is this. It's the noises, it's the volume at which the saliva and the sloppiness comes on his (laughs) penis, and then it's the hand usage. And when I say hand usage, and every guy in this room, (laughs) just close your eyes, because you're all going to show me which one is going to be so happy to hear this. The double hand lets him know that piece is ginormous. You got to hit him with the double hand because he's like, God damn, my shit's big. You have to. So what I'm saying, though, is for a 3,000 to a 9,000, there's very different levels at which how sloppy are you getting? How crazy are you getting with your hands? Are your hands going in the same motion or are they going in different motions? Left hand's going right, right hand's going left, and we're switching that shit up and we're going on the merry-go-round, motherfuckers. Lefty, righty, righty. 
Wow, sloppy. I feel like I want to text that to a guy right now. Can I give you a sloppy blowjob? I feel like he's going to go Dude, from 6 to midnight. There, wow. there is no thing that is considered a blowjob <laughs> unless it is the sloppiest, wettest, nastiest thing you've That's ever seen. You're so like, hot. you, if you, okay, and this is what he claims. Research shows, he said, <laughs> within 24 hours, you will you know. You my girlfriend? No, no. Well, kind of, actually. <laughs> Within 24 hours, if you do the gluck gluck, which I mean, you're double hand twisting, you're vacuum sealing, you are the sloppiest girl in the room. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I swear I'm not degrading women. I'm just giving you guys tips here because I swear it works. Okay. In 24 hours post blowjob, you will know if you are a 9,000 performer or if you're a 3,000 performer. Oh. 9,000 is like you ramp everything the fuck up. It's like if you're on a treadmill and you're at speed three, I'm like, me and my <laughs> My grandma are chilling and nine no bitch is fucking catching me to the finish line because i'm about to make this guy come faster than life oh okay <laughs> i feel like i must be a three thousand because i didn't know about the hand motion well you know we have bananas in our apartment thought, and we know we're gonna get to the nine thousand no. level real fucking quick i genuinely thought it was all about the deep throat is that not a thing anymore listen, am i living in the past when i is tell you two years old when i tell you i don't know anymore listen fucking cobwebs down there Just when i tell you bed. noise takes a guy from a zero oh to a hundred you like we said you are dying for that dick put on a soundtrack of your mouth oh okay. my god like what i just did <laughs> no 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 like <laughs> like oh <laughs> make noise and he will actually come so mm-hmm. like i said guaranteed if you are at the nine thousand level and ladies i'll let you research a little bit and if you guys want to write in let me know if you want me to actually go into more detail well. you can let me know but i know my dad listens so hi dad whatever okay guaranteed he okay. will start texting you back faster yeah, he will randomly hit you with the FaceTimes. He may start to send you little cute animal emojis in the DMs. And, you know, the guy is literally going to be like, babe, have you eaten today? And send you that Uber I Eats. I just don't know if BDs are that important. Let Okay, okay. <laughs> Let me just say this. Okay. Are they? This is beginning episode whatever of the Alex Cooper testimony on blowjobs. <laughs> Here we go. If you are not sucking your man's dick that's fine 100 percent your decision Mm -hmm. i respect it i understand it however if you are not somebody else is (laughs) i'm sorry (laughs) it's the truth let me just say no guy is in a committed faithful serious relationship and he is abstaining from oral sex i'm sorry every girl can hate me in america but i'm telling you the truth i swear to god you can have great sex absolutely get down and do your damn thing but a blowjob and sex are completely different experiences and you can't just satisfy one you need to satisfy both what just came out of your mouth i'm still dude i sound like i suck dick for a living my god i'm like whoa i just know i wish i I had a dick so you could suck it at this point i'm excited i I know you're getting like oh god alex no i i'm just telling you that's that's my experience and that's what i know well and i understand and i agree slash disagree okay you know the guy my ex who i obviously (laughs) you know (laughs) refer to frequently He's a time. Maybe actually, because he's having fucking foursomes and another girl sucks his dick for him. I don't have to worry about it. No, I just feel like sometimes a blowjob is not the most important thing to a guy. My ex would tell me. I feel like every guy in the subway that's listening to this no. morning is like rolling their eyes like, oh my God, Sophia, Whatever. come on, no. suck my dick. No, they know better. They know okay. Oh, okay. that okay. sometimes... It's nowhere near as important as having great sex. No, you know what? I I swear to God, my ex would tell me. I would be like, I want to suck your dick more. (laughs) Okay. And he would be like, I, you know, that's great. But like, I just sex for me. And like, our sex is so much more important. So much hotter, blah, blah, blah. And that wasn't just because I sucked (laughs) at giving head. Which I know everyone's thinking. (laughs) Oh my God. He genuinely was like that. And I could tell. And you know what? With that, so I'm going to say something more important. Oh, because we're fucking talking about how to get a guy off this entire podcast. How about if you're dying for that dick and giving him the gluck gluck 3000, <laughs> you better be suffocating his fucking face with your labia. Boom! <laughs> and that's oh. it. And this is serious. And that's what should be happening if you're going to do that. And even if you're not, he should be going down on you for 45 minutes Hopefully knowing how to do it. Giving you the whole treatment. I agree. Wait a second. Hold on. My mom will be so proud. I want (laughs) to clarify this podcast is not just about like 
you know, please your man and no. make him come. No, this is also about guys. We're going to get to you. Don't worry. I know you're sitting on there like, yo, Alex and Sophia are giving us the <laughs> shit. No, no, no. We're about to. Apparently, I'm not we're giving about to anyone shit. So. <laughs> we're about to roast you. What I'm saying is, you guys, I, I pray to God, Tom Brady does not watch film he is the best. Why does he still watch film? You can be the best at something. There's always room for improvement. I swear it's so imperative. Some people think porn is the craziest thing. Watch porn together. What do you want to, What do you want your man to do to you? Show. Send him a video of it. What do you want your guy to do to you? Show him. Because yeah. at the end of the day, 